Bedtime Stories by Miss RR Our story for today is about Keeper and the Giant Keeper was watching television. He was watching a program called The Angry Giant. He liked the program. The Angry Giant lived in a castle near a village. Nobody in the village liked the giant. He was always gross. When the giant was gross, he stomped his feet and the houses shook. Oh no, everyone said. He's gross again. He's always gross. Pippa went to find Chip, but he was out. He picked up the magic key and it began to glow. Oh, said Keeper. He ran to get Beef, but she was out with Chip. The magic began to work. It took Keeper inside the magic house. The magic took Keeper to the gate of the giant's castle. Keeper was frightened. He saw a signpost. It pointed to the village. He didn't want to meet the giant, so he went to the village. Keeper came to the village, but it was tiny. Keeper was a giant. Oh no, said Keeper. Go away, yelled the people. We don't want you. We've got one giant. We don't want another one. The people threw things at Keeper. Go away, they yelled. We don't want another giant! We don't want you! Stop it! shouted Keeper. I'm not a giant! I'm a boy! The people said, Well, you look like a giant! Keeper began to cry. Oh, I'm not a giant, he said. I'm a little boy and I don't like this adventure. Giants don't cry, said the people. Perhaps he is a little boy, but he looks like a giant to us. Perhaps he can help us? Hippa helped the villagers to mend their houses. He put back the broken roofs. Good old keeper, everyone said. The giant threw this big stone at us, said the people. We don't want it here. Can you put it outside the village? Yes, said keeper. I'll try. He picked up the stone and took it outside the village. Good old keeper, everyone called. All the people liked keeper. Thank you, they said. You have helped us a lot. The village band played for him. The giant came back. He was very angry when he saw keeper in the village. Oh, the giant here, he shouted. He ran towards the village. Gosh! He fell over the stone. Ouch! He yelled. The people were frightened, but Keeper went to help the giant. He picked up the giant's things and put a bandage around his head. Keeper was bigger than the giant. Be a good giant, said Keeper. Stop being angry and the people will like you. So the giant stopped being angry. I'll try to be good, he said. Hooray, shouted the people. Let's have a party. The key began to glow. It's time for me to go now, said Keeper. Goodbye, thank you for the party. The magic took Keeper home. Nobody likes an angry giant, said Keeper. What an adventure. 